In this video, we'll try to understand the logic and function which is used in case of pneumatic circuit. Now the arrangement of the circuit is as shown over here. The various components which are used are FRL unit, start wall which is the direction control wall and it is normally open wall. Then we are having push button operated direction control wall. Then roller operated 3 by 2 direction control wall as indicated over here. Then dual pressure wall which is an important part of this particular and circuit and logic circuit. Then 5 by 2 direction control wall and the double acting cylinder. For the given particular arrangement there is a retraction of the piston in case of the double acting cylinder and that is nothing but the return stroke. Now how this particular circuit works that we have to understand. Air from compressor as you can see over here the red line indicates the flow of air. So air from compressor it enters into the FRL unit and then it enters into the left envelope of the start wall. From this it will enter. On this side this is the block position because push button is not operated, is not operated or is not pressed. So the air will go from this side. Now this is the roller operated 3 by 2 direction control wall. The cam is pressing this particular roller for the given arrangement and therefore this is the left envelope mode that we are obtaining over here. So the air from this path will go over here and this is the first input that is provided to the dual pressure wall. Dual pressure wall will operate only when two inputs are there. Now as there is only one input pressure input is there it will not produce any output. So there will not be any output that will be produced at point two and therefore the air from this particular so that is indicated by this blue line it will enter over here and from one it will enter into two and then from two the air will enter into the rod side of the double acting cylinder and the air from the other side will go from four to five to the atmosphere so air is discharged to the atmosphere through this particular line now this is the first arrangement where we have obtained the return stroke. So there is a retraction of the piston inside the double acting cylinder. Now we have to understand the circuit when the second input is provided. So the, when we operate this particular push button or when push button is pressed then this left envelope mode will be present over here. So that we will see in the next circuit. So as you can see over here air from compressor it will enter into the FRL unit that is filter regulator and lubricator unit then through the start wall the air will go over here. Now we are having the cam which is pressing this roller so this is the left envelope mode which is the open position you can say and the first input is provided to the dual pressure wall. Now when the push button is pressed then we will get the left envelope mode. So now we have to observe carefully. So we are getting this particular left envelope mode. So the air from now this particular side it will enter from 1 to 2 and will be given as second input to the dual pressure wall. Now there is input 1 and input 2. So two inputs are provided and therefore the output will be obtained from this dual pressure wall. So we can say that input 1 and input 2 they are necessary to produce the output 2 and therefore it is known as the AND logic function. So from 2 it will go over here and then it will operate this left envelope mode. So again operate again observe carefully this particular left envelope mode this is the pilot line and we will get the left envelope mode. Now as we are getting this left envelope mode this particular blue line that is the path of the air will indicate you from 1 the air will enter to 4 port 4 and then it will enter into the cylinder side of the double acting cylinder. Now the piston will move in the forward direction and the air from the rod side from 2 it will enter into port 3 and then it will be discharged to the atmosphere. So in this way we are having the dual pressure wall which is working as the AND logic function that when it receives 2 input then and only then it will produce the output 2 and when this output 2 is produced then the pilot operated 5 by 2 DC wall gets operated. Thank you very much for watching.